do is um, put our rice on. Now um, I have here in a small saucepan a half cup of rice, one and one third cups water, and a tablespoon of butter. Now we're going to put that on a burner for um, until it starts to boil, and then we're going to um, uh, stir it a lot. Um, the key to good rice is to keep on stirring it so it doesn't stick. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on the burner and bring it to a boil. And the best thing I think to use is a a um, like a rubber spatula. These ones are like uh, silicone. These are awesome. Um, so I'll put it to the side. Now we're going to go ahead and um, prepare our fish. Okay, I'm going to pat my fish dry. As you're patting it, just make sure there's nothing wrong with your fish. Make sure there's no bones in it. Make sure that um, there's no scales. If scales were left on it, that wouldn't be pleasant to come across when you're trying to eat. And you guys can use um, pretty much any fish. This is um, Scarlet Snapper. You guys can use um, tilapia, which is really easy to work with, or cod. It doesn't matter. Um, I'm going to add some ground mustard. Some garlic powder. Some paprika. And some parsley. And put a little bit of olive oil in it. We're going to heat this up on medium heat. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is prep our fancy dressed up um, broccoli. So I have a medium sized onion here, and we're just going to um, dice it up. And if you find that onions really bother you when you cut them, just, um, just uh, put it in the freezer for about 10 20 minutes and all the juices will freeze. Okay, now we're going to cut up some garlic. A larger saucepan, and just drizzle some in there. I'm just going to put um, some of the frozen bro broccoli florets in there. Now we're going to put this um, and the onions in on the heat over medium heat for a little while until it starts to tender up or um, melt the ice with just the onions because garlic will um, cook real fast and um, it'll burn if you uh, keep it on for too long. We're going to put our fillets on and it might get it a little loud. Try talking over the sizzling here, but um, I'm going to show you our rice here. Nice and fluffy, and it's a little bit, a little bit too damp in there, so I'm going to take the lid off and um, give it a couple stirs here, and wait for the, the the rest of the liquid to evaporate, and then um, the rice will be done and it'll be set to cool. So I'm going to go ahead and turn the heat off on that one. And, um, yeah, so there's the fish. Um, I went ahead and salt and peppered the, um, the skin side, so there's flavor all around. So we're just going to wait until, um, both sides become opaque, which is, um, really, really white that you can't see, like, um, the peachy... Um, flesh. 
And then we're going to cook our broccoli, which is over here in the covered saucepan until it's on a higher setting, it's a medium high, until um, it's, uh, it's uh, nice and firm and then, or nice and soft, I'm sorry. And then we're going to put some garlic in there and saute it. All right, so um, we'll be back in a little bit. I wanted to show you real quick the nice, brown, crispy crust that we just got on the fish. And I flipped it over, and I don't know if you can see, I'll try to zoom in, um, but I don't know. So, um, you can see that it's, this is the color that we want on both sides right here. So, nice white color. And then, um, I don't know if you guys can see, where is that? Right here where it's cracking, that means the fish is um, becoming flaky. And that's, that's the sign of a done fish when um, it becomes flaky. So I just flip them over and we're going to cook on that side for a little bit. And um, I'll meet you back. And here you guys go. This is the finished product. We have our um, beautiful white rice. We have our um, filet of scarlet um, snapper. And we have our fancy dressed up. Um, broccoli. So uh, thanks for watching guys and stay tuned for the next video. Bye bye.